Hey guys, welcome to this week's video. Uh, it's going to be a shorter video this week, just kind of going over the range session and kind of uh, go through the go through the round I had earlier today, um, the round I had uh, on Sunday. So start off with the range session. In this range session, I'm really working on um, completing my turn as well as uh, after watching some of the videos with uh, from George. One of the things that I am working on is digging into the ground with my back foot and kind of using that as a pit, as a trigger for my uh, for my downswing. And so, yeah, you can really see I'm kind of getting it, get trying to complete the full turn, and then pivot into the ground with my back foot and use that as a trigger for the downswing. Um, you know, I was I was at the range with a buddy. Uh, you know, we worked on some things, then we kind of had a, had a chip off, a wedge off to different flags in the, uh, in the area. The other thing I really noticed when we were at the range was, um, you know, really good. It was really windy. Um, my wedges were really good within, you know, 75 to a hundred were decent within 75 to a hundred yards. Um, but after a hundred yards, I could not control it. Um, that's probably pretty obvious on the course too. Um, you know, from 100 to 150 is really an area where I struggle. Uh, so definitely going to be working on that in the future, as well as working on, um, you know, keeping it sharp within 100. I was pretty impressed. Um, you know, we did three shots for three points. Uh, I won, uh, I think, three out of the four that we did. Um, granted, he hadn't played in a while. Uh, just kind of gotten out swinging the first time in a month, but you know, put the ball close. Uh, so yeah, moving on to uh, my round. Uh, played with two new people that I've never played with before. Uh, I shot an 84, which I'm pretty happy about. Uh, two birdies, that's always big. Uh, one of the biggest things that stood out with me was greens and regulation. Um, let's see here. I think I only hit a total of Huh. three greens in regulation. So, uh, yeah, that's going to make it hard. Um, as well as I only hit a total of seven fairways. So I think that starts with working on the driver as well. Um, something that I'm going to work on more here once uh, daylight comes and you can go to the range a little more often. Um, so, yeah, I'm trying to get it in the fairway and then utilizing it from the fairway to hit the green. Um, and then again, I just struggle from, uh, you know, anything over, especially over 150, um, but definitely 100 to 200 um, right in there. Uh, the other thing was uh, putts. I had a total of 34 putts, so that number's kind of high, but I also think that that's because I'm not putting it close. Um, I mean, I did make a bunch of putts on the front nine to kind of keep my score low. I shot a 41 on the front, 45 on the back. That was the other thing that uh, was really concerning was, um, well, before I talk about that, one thing that I was really proud about was that um, during the round, uh, I kind of let the, you know, on hole number three, I, got a, I ended up getting a seven uh, par four or par five ended up getting a seven. And then on uh, the next hole, hole number four, I tried to take a line that I normally take and didn't hit it very well. Um, ball went maybe 50 yards. So I really set myself up, uh, took a six there, really let that start getting to me and kind of change the course of my round and you know spiral down. But what I did was I stayed patient, I stayed calm, and I ended up birdieing the next hole, which was one of the hardest holes uh, I was proud of, hit it out of a divot. Uh, it was really cool. Um, bounced back, rattled off two pars after that. And um, so I was really proud of that mental game. Uh, you know, staying present, not letting the pass get to me. Uh, but then again, towards the end, and I don't know if this was the mental game, but the, it really started to get away. Uh, hit a ball OB on the 17th hole um, on a par five. So. You know, I don't know if that's, you know, 
I don't know what that is, is that if I'm not eating or you know something like that that kind of ruins the energy and gets the energy low but you know future state I'm gonna start looking into that and seeing how to finish rounds strong um, so yeah that's kind of a little bit for this week Um, thank you guys for watching this video. Uh, make sure you like and subscribe as well as uh, next week will be really interesting video. I got uh, two or well, it'll be another course vlog uh, on the course. So nine holes at Country Hills, which was a lot of fun. Awesome. Thanks for watching guys.